briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. A Supreme Court of Appeals case in West Virginia, Bryant v. Willison Real Estate Company, focused on a sales contract in which the vendor bore the risk of loss, making the doctrine of equitable conversion inapplicable. This meant that the purchaser was not responsible for damages caused by a waterline break in the O.J. Morrison building, which they had made a $10,000 down payment on. After the water damage, the plaintiffs asked the vendors to repair the damage or rescind the contract, but were refused. The vendors later sold the building to another purchaser for $140,000, and the plaintiffs sued for rescission and their down payment. The trial court denied the plaintiff's claim and awarded damages against the plaintiffs for the water damage to adjacent businesses based on the doctrine of equitable conversion. However, the court ultimately reversed this decision as the sales contract specified that the vendors bore the risk of loss. The case was remanded for further proceedings on damages with the purchasers likely entitled to their down payment and interest. The vendors were unable to recover the difference between the original and subsequent sales prices as they bore the risk of loss. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lsc.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.